people do. Some time ago, I purchased some power banks on Amazon. I have them for a while, which yesterday I went on Amazon to see if they were still available. And they were not. They are DIY power banks. This is one of them. It's a solar power bank and it has a panel light and a flashlight. When you squeeze the panel light comes on, you squeeze again, the indicator light comes on, panel light, flashlight, The panel light has two functions, but for some reason I cannot uh, get it now. This is the power bank, one of them. It holds five batteries in it this is what it looks like the DIY, DIY project You have, that's the screws in the bag. You have to put everything up, the face, the border. This is the border. You have to solder, cut your wires and solder it. This is the solar panel. You have to solder the wires onto that also. And these are the LEDs. You also have to solder your wires on. It's really a challenge. This one, it was a challenge. I, uh, but I put it together and uh, it's working. I haven't, well, it's no longer mine, I give it away. I bought them, experimented on them and uh, give them away but sometime or should i say in the next video i'll show you all how i put up this one and these are the batteries i took off from a laptop power bank i have some more batteries there i made this tester instead of using my multi-purpose meter fiddling with leads i put the batteries in here and check for the voltage 
of them. But the one we're going to be working on uh, today, actually it's one of the easier ones. Uh, this is it. Power bank. The first one I put up, I give it away. So I decide to hold this one uh, to demonstrate to you all how easy it is to make your own power bank. I think this case cost me three dollars. That case cost me four four dollars just for the case itself. Just an empty shell, no batteries. That's if in case you want to do your own power bank. Now, to put the batteries in, I actually have some batteries. You have to make sure that they are the same voltage so one won't be draining the other one. This here is the negative. This real here is the positive. This down here is the negative. You place your batteries in. The negative side goes on the spring. The positive side goes at the top. You put in the next one. Just make sure the polarity is right. And the other one, when it comes to the top, you put negative on the spring, positive down here. The same thing with the other one, negative on the spring, positive down here. This is the light and we have 67% charge. That's all there is to it this is where you put your cable to charge it this is where you charge your phone here it has two ports now at the back they say input plus five percent one amp output five volts plus five percent two point one amp i don't know if each of them given two point one amp that i would have to test because usually they will tell you something and it's something else but since the batteries i have in here is not new i won't be able to verify what they say because the batteries are not new and you put your case on 
it just has some clips I hope you could see that it has some clips all around it so you get it in make sure it's position right and you squeeze until you had a click it snaps in now it will take a bit of fiddling to get it in this is what the power bank looks like no let me put off that light let me get this is a that indicates that it's charging And that indicates that the phone is charging. I hope you all can see that. Let me remove it again. Put the phone off. Plug it back in. This is it. I've got a, a drop tester, which I will be doing a, a review on. Five point seventeen volts. Yeah, five point seventeen volts at one point five three. And right now it's a four point nine five volts at one point five three amps. Let me see the other one.
the other one is 4.95 1.5 amps just bear in mind that it's not a hundred percent charge it's only 95 percent if you find this video as helpful please like subscribe and click on the bell icon to be notified of further videos Thank you. Better let go. You decide if you're ever gonna.